Hey, good morning to everybody. Happy Thursday. It's Daryl here. It is bright and freaking early, 4 a.m. here in Connecticut on the East Coast. Okay, honestly, I had to wait and I had to wait a half hour before I right now before I make this video right now. I was so angry this morning. My heart's still pounding right now. I, I haven't gotten, I, I hate, I hate when I, I lose control this much, when I, I, I get this angry over something uh, that I can't even do anything about right at the moment. Um, I came across a video this morning. I'm going to try to be ob as objective as possible uh, when I describe this video. All right. Uh, I came across a video. It's a right wing leaning man. Uh, his name is Justin Andrich. He's got, I think he's got a channel here on YouTube. I found some of his videos and similar videos. Uh, it talks about the MMA combat and the green leafy substance. I got to be careful. Uh, I, I, I want to make sure this video gets, gets on YouTube. Um, uh, his channel is called uh, The Green Leafy Substance that I was talking about and combat it's called. Um, okay, so the video starts off at Justin's table, this right wing guy. And I think it's somebody filming Justin, like one of his friends or whatever, filming him. And he gets up and he confronts the Democrat governor of Nevada, uh, Steve Sislak, in a restaurant. And then he just, I don't have any other word for this, but, but bullies him, uh, chases him outside, all sorts of disgusting comments about his wife, about his uh, the Asian heritage of his wife, and all this other stuff. Um, you know what? I don't know Steve Sislak. I don't know him from Joe Schmo. Uh, yeah, I'm a Democrat. I'm a liberal. I'm a progressive. I, I am everything this guy does not like. You know, it, so this, this guy was started off by, say, talking about how this governor, Steve Sislak, is in the wor New World Order. Well, just for the hell of it, I might as well say, hey, I, I'm, I'm part of the New World Order, too, too, just in case good old Justin watches this. Yeah. I'm part of that new world order. Uh, okay. And uh, I, I don't know the governor here. So I'm not going to, you know what, I'm not going to defend him. I, I don't know what he's being accused of. What I want to talk about is Justin Andrich's methods here. What he did in that restaurant. And why I'm so angry about it. All right. Justin Andrich is, is a coward. Look at, look at the man he's confronting and the way he goes about it. I'm sure Justin considers himself an alpha male and a patriot and a combat fighter and all this other stuff. Okay, if you got legitimate gripes against this guy, pre present your evidence. Uh, you don't do this on a, in a restaurant. And the thing that I'm most... You look at the governor. Look, look at his face as you chase him outside and stuff. I, I can't even say the stuff that Justin was saying. Uh, about what he wants to do to this guy. Uh, you know, it's, it's just, a, it's, Justin is just talking about sick violence. Uh, nothing to do, you know, no, no, no trial by jury or anything like that. Just sick mob justice for whatever he perceives the Democrat governor has done. Uh, what bothers me the most about this video is the people in this restaurant. Now, this is the kind of guy that always talks about the children. I, I think he says something about children in this video as he's spewing off all this crazy right-wing rhetoric. I think he said something. What about the parents? What about the good people that were in that restaurant that had to hear your obscenity-laced garbage? What do you think the kids are going to go home? How, how they're going to go home? What they're going to have to say when they, they ask what this word meant, what that word meant? Why was that mo that man so angry, mom? You know, you profess to love you know all about America, you know, uh, all about morals and the right thing, and and against these you know your messed up uh, cabal and all that stuff. What about? The good families and children, that's what got me so angry this morning. When I, I came across my mind, I was like, what about, it looks like there's probably about 20 or 30 people sitting in this restaurant, I'm guessing. What, what about them? 
and he chases this man out into the parking lot. Now, this this guy, Justin Andrich, is easily in his 20s, maybe in his 30s. A fit guy. Uh, Steve Sislak, the governor, he, he he's, he's shorter by probably a good 8 inches, overweight. The guy is probably older than me, probably around 60, 60-something. 60 you know, there's no physical, you know... Justin Andrews easily, easily has the physical strength, has the physical um, advantage over this guy. And it's just nothing but pure bullying. He chases him out into the parking lot. The thing that bothers me, he's just like every other bully I have seen, every single other bully I've seen in my life. The more that he, he, he gets the scent of fear, off the governor, the more wild and, 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 and out of control he gets. Because he knows this governor isn't going to do nothing. He knows there's no way that he's going to get harmed, that he's going to get struck. There's gonna, he knows there's no way there's going to be any physical confronta confrontation. And he, th and he sees the fear in the governor. And the governor is terrified. Because he, th he, he feels the opposite. He feels he's about to get struck. He fears for his family. You do this in front of the man's wife, in front of his family, in front of the families and children in this restaurant. That is inexcusable. The work of a coward and a bully. Uh, <laughs> you can watch the video for yourself. Uh, I have so much more to say there, but uh, as you can tell, I'm a little biased on this. Uh, Justin Andrews, you're nothing but a coward and a bully. All right, I'll be back later with another video. You guys have a good Thursday.